Welcome to the Pro Kitchen Open Close Doors and Drawers video tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to take a look at the Open and Close Doors and Drawers feature that we actually introduced several weeks ago with Pro Kitchen. Now we've got a few catalogs up and ready for them, and so we're ready to teach everybody how to use it. So let's get started here. I'm just going to pull up a little layout I've got going here. And uh, the first thing we're going to look at is how to open and close doors individually from our info panel. So here I'm going to open a cabinet. We'll pull up a righty here so the door opens the right direction for us. You can see my cabinet and my info panel here. Now if your image is showing up like this, then you just simply need to bring your mouse up here, double click, and it'll pull open your cabinet. Now a single click, either right click or left click, from here will open and close the cabinet door. Pretty easy, huh? Just a simple click. And it, it doesn't matter which mouse button you click on, either right mouse button or left mouse button. Um, for PC anyways, I'm not sure I haven't tried both mouse buttons in Mac. Um, but then here, we can also open and close from attributes. So we're going to open over here our 2430 or 3024. We're going to go to attributes. And from attributes, we've got a little slider bar across the bottom that we can use. As we slide this, we can open and close partially or all the way, or not at all. Again, a single left click or right click will open and close. And a double click will bring open your 2D view. And so there we have it for attributes. Now let's take a look at the feature in 3D. We'll create a 3D. Let it burn up here. And we'll zoom in a little bit. Move it over and rotate. Get a nice angle on it so it looks good. All right, here we go. And now we've got an open and close doors icon up here. We click it to open. Click it again to close. Now once it's open, you'll notice we've got pots and vases and plates and I don't know, it looks like a blender, uh, dividers, pots and pans, all sorts of good stuff in the interior of these cabinets. We simply selected these from the catalog, um, from our uh, decorate, decorative items catalog, and we just placed them in, placed them in, um, in the design, did a little up down, maybe a little in out, depending on where they were placed at, to get them in so that they look like they were sitting inside the, the cabinets. And let's see, click to close. There we have it. So we can close this off. So hopefully this little feature will help you increase your sales as you demonstrate this to your customers so that they can see what the insides of your cabinets look like. Um, we're busy building up the rest of the catalogs. Like I said, we've had, we have a couple ready and released. Um, we're busy building the rest of them with those updates, and they should be out shortly. So you'll be able to have all your update or all your catalogs um, shortly will be updated to work with this new feature. I hope you enjoy it, and I hope it increases your sales. Thank you for watching the Pro Kitchen Open and Close Doors video tutorial.